some pizza pockets and we use store-bought dough this time we're making our own dough right here really easy instructions on the back we're gonna be using them right here let's get started It says that we need to knead the dough by hand for three minutes or until it's soft or smooth. Soft and smooth. Okay guys, now I gotta let the dough rise in a warm place until it doubles in size, it takes about 45 minutes. circle guys this time we have pizza sauce not um, spaghetti sauce perfect circle now, like a good circle. I mean, the circle looks pretty good right now, but if I pick it up and put it on the tray, it's not going to end up that well. So I'm going to try. mushrooms on. It's looking pretty good. I put it up for 
13 minutes, so we're gonna check it out later and see how it turns out. While we're waiting, I'm gonna be making Coke floats for our drinks. This one looks okay. This one needs a little bit longer. Okay. Looks all right. <laughs> you can just use your hands, Kate. We don't care. It's hot though. What's hot? Just came out of the oven fresh. And I think this is, might be my first review. Yeah, I think um, Kate and I have done all the other reviews before. Okay, Janet scored one to 10, 10 being the best score. Let's take a look at the undercarriage. Ooh, looks pretty good there, guys. Just to let you know, I haven't Smells tried it. Smells pretty good. Just to let you know, I haven't tried it yet. Okay. Mmm. This is pretty good. It's hot. It's hot. I'm going to take a bite of the crust now. Mmm. Crispy. Not much flop. Holds its shape pretty good. Go ahead. Tastes like a regular pizza. Tastes like a regular pizza. Yeah, one to ten. Um, seven. Here we go. Yeah, it's pretty good. I like it. What do you rate it? I like a little more sauce on it, but it's pretty good. Um, seven point eight. Good job, Kate. Thank you. Delish. And nutrish. I like my cake. What's that? Cook float. Ooh. 10 out of 10 right here. This one right here, 10 out of 10. 